This year was a big year for Sam Hewen. He received the BAFTA Scotland Audience Award in November and recently won the International Icon Award at the Esquire Ceremony. What did fans say about hearing the news? Also, a co-star of Sam Hewen and his close friend responded most hilariously after Sam Hewen posted the news on social media. Keep watching for more information on this. First up, Sam Hewen teases that Jamie Fraser may need prosthetics in Huge Season 7. A 16-episode supersized season of Outlander 7 is scheduled to air on stars in the upcoming weeks. The current Droughtlander, 8 months and counting, will finish in the early months of 2023, according to showrunner Matthew B. Roberts. However, Stars has not yet formally informed viewers of the date. We also know that some beloved characters from the previous seasons of the popular Stars series Outlander will return in the forthcoming seventh season. The historical slash time travel television program is based on the highly successful Diana Gobbledone book series of the same name. As fans eagerly await that information about when exactly the seventh season will air, Sam Hewen, who plays Jamie Fraser, has said that his character might require prosthetics in the upcoming huge season. Katrina Balfe's pregnancy caused season six of Outlander to be shortened to just eight episodes. The last four episodes will now be added to the start of season seven, making a total of 16 episodes. Due to the short season, the plot ended on a cliffhanger, with Jamie rushing at full speed on a horse to try to save Claire as she was brought to jail to stand trial. It's enormous. The American Revolutionary War is ongoing. Claire is imprisoned and and Jamie is attempting to free her. Hewen told Cinema Blend that the film is incredibly action-packed and moving along really effectively. Richard Brown, played by Chris Larkin, who was following the couple as they made their way to Wilmington, caught up with them and forced them apart so he could kidnap Claire. She is accused of killing Malva Christie, played by Jessica Reynolds, a crime she did not commit. Due to aging and near-death experience, experiences, Jamie has had some physical changes throughout the series. The character is now in his 50s. When the story started, he was in his 20s. When Jamie receives aid from Claire and her future medical expertise, the traumatic, nearly fatal encounters have also altered Jamie's appearance. His hand was shattered with a hammer while being tortured by Black Jack Randall, and he almost lost the ability to use it. They had also nailed his finger to a wooden table. Jamie was repeatedly beaten, leaving him with significant scars on his back. When he stood up for his sister against Randall and his men's onslaught, he endured 200 whippings and came dangerously close to dying. Hewen claims that season 7 will have greater physical alterations for Jamie, including the use of prosthetics. The Scot, however, did not provide any further information. Young Ian's fate is is teased by Outlander's new behind-the-scenes photo. John was pictured smiling broadly and seated on a rock in a picture posted by Outlander's official account. This may hint at the Highlander's future, even if the actor and showrunners have been mum regarding young Ian's storyline. He and Jamie were galloping into Williamton to try to save Claire the last time spectators saw him. Young Ian has had a desire for adventure since his his debut in season three, frequently putting him in perilous circumstances. Ian resolved to swap places with Roger McKenzie, who had been kidnapped by the Mohawk tribe after spending years living with his uncle Jamie. But after being gone for the bulk of season four, Ian made a broken-hearted comeback to the ridge. It was revealed that after several unsuccessful pregnancies, Ian was instructed to leave the Mohawk tribe. Sadly, the Mohawk tribe felt Ian spirit was not powerful enough for a kid to take root in the womb, since they believed the man's spirit had to battle with the woman's and overcome it. He and Emily were, therefore, no longer compatible, and he returned to his family. 
Ian finally ran into Kahira Tan, his old Mohawk friend, as the show progressed. However, he was heartbroken to learn he had wed Emily. After enduring a great deal of betrayal and heartache, the happy picture might portend Ian's future happiness. Fans expect that Claire's successful rescue will open season 7, but in typical Outlander fashion, it's unlikely to be an easy mission. Ian had periodically expressed his appreciation for Claire and Jamie relationship. Perhaps the young Scott would find love once more. In either case, viewers will have to wait until the season 7 premiere to learn what is in store for young Ian. Sam Hewen won the BAFTA Scotland Audience Award in November. After collecting a prize from BAFTA Scotland, Sam Hewen, the star of the television series Outlander, has received a deluge of congratulations from viewers. The actor was recognized for his work in the well-liked stars drama with the Audience Award, which is given to audiences' favorite Scott on television. The 42-year-old posted on Instagram, saying thank you to everyone who voted. He also stated that he was really happy for everyone who contributes to Outlander, and that celebrating with the crew was a lot of fun. Fans quickly congratulated the Jamie Fraser actor in the comments, with one person congratulating Sam and saying he truly deserved it. They also thanked him for bringing such a lovely character to life with such love, devotion, courage, and passion. Sam Hewen's portrayal of the character makes Jamie Fraser so adored, recognizable, and memorable. A second supporter said that Sam deserved it so much, and they were happy for him. They also stated that they sincerely hope he feels the love his supporters have for him. Fans also reacted to his touching acceptance speech, in which he disclosed that that throughout its six seasons, the show has employed 5,000 extras, 650 cast members, and 2,800 Scottish crew members. A fan stated that Sam deserved it so much and that his speech of gratitude was pure and brilliant. They continued by stating that Sam demonstrates to the world what it is to be simultaneously humble, kind, and grateful. Another fan congratulated him on his achievement and also congratulated the Outlander crew as well. You presented a lovely, insightful speech. Wonderful. The wonderful news was announced just a few weeks after Sam shared his devastating father's death story with Jackie Bird on an edition of the Love Scotland podcast. He said that the loss of his father was a major time in his life, saying that it was during the beginning of season one of Outlander shooting. Sam Hewen is honored to accept yet another significant award to the admiration of Outlander fans. Fans of Outlander were overjoyed to find that their favorite Highlander had won yet another important award for his contributions to and involvement with the wildly popular historical drama. Due to the success of his best-selling memoir Waypoints, Scottish actor Sam Hewen has had an even busier year than normal. The star of the star's drama's upcoming season of Outlander took to Instagram to celebrate his great night at this year's Esquire Man of the Year Award awards before reprising his enduring role as Jamie Fraser. As Sam celebrated the honor on social media, fans congratulated him on being selected as Esquire's international icon. In a recent post, the Outlander actor was seen giving his speech and congratulating other well-known winners, Pablo Alberon, Miguel Angel Silvestre, Dani Garcia, Arturo Valls, Angel Martin, Ismael Cruz Cordoba, and Rafael Perez Santa Marina are all included on the list of winners. Rafael Nadal, a 22-time Grand Slam champion, received the title of Man of the Year in honor of his accomplishments during the previous 12 months. As a caption for his photo, he thanked the organization responsible for the award, saying it was an amazing night celebrating Esquire Man of the Year 2022. He then stated that it was an honor to accept the title of International Icon and rejoice alongside such amazing people. He then congratulated Rafael Nadal. The Outlander actor's 3.9 million fans were ecstatic to see him add yet another trophy to his growing resume of successes. A fan commented that Sam is now in 
international man of mystery. Another fan commented that his speech was incredibly moving. The fan also expressed their gratitude for Sam using his platform and voice to advocate, saying he is selfless and modest, and they are incredibly appreciative of him. Sam Hewen of Outlander celebrates a significant accomplishment, and his co-star responds best. The TV star was quick to share the joyful news and some behind-the-scenes pictures from the event on Instagram after being named this year's international icon. It elicited the nicest response from one of his Outlander co-stars. Sam's leading lady, Katrina Balfe, responded with a number of clapping emojis. With his remark, Graham McTavish, who plays Dougal McKenzie in the popular historical drama, had viewers in stitches. The two have a humorous, bantering friendship, as evidenced by the simple, oh no, response. Sam and Graham became fast friends after meeting on the set of Outlander, and they went on to collaborate on two books, Clan Lands, Whiskey, Warfare, and a Scottish Adventure Like No Other, and The Clan Lands Almanac, seasonal stories from Scotland. Additionally, they co-starred in their own travel program, Men in Kilts, a road trip with Sam and Graham, which was just given a second season. Sam and Graham provided fans with yet another look into their funny friendship in November, while thanking the American Reality Television Awards and their supporters for supporting men in kilts. Graham jokingly said that what's even more astounding is that they were actually in separate rooms in the same building in the video, which Sam posted on Instagram. Sam agreed and said, yes, they were essentially kept apart to decompress. Graham then jokingly said that, basically, to recover his sanity, his therapist is only off camera, but she's here at all times now. Sam continued, saying that if Graham could keep the noise down, it would be fantastic. Another recent post that Graham shared on social media had his fans giggling as well. Graham shared a series of photos online to commemorate the publication of Sam's book, Waypoints, My Scottish Journey, in which he appeared to be reading it while somewhat horrified. The caption basically stated that Sam's book's contents are slowly becoming apparent to the reader. We have come to the end of today's video. What do you think about Graham's response to Sam Hewen's post? Are you also a big fan of Sam Hewen? Let us know in the comment section. Please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.